So let's talk about something a little bit more technical. Some time ago, I was working with a dev team, and we were super excited to build this app for a community center. It was a community center that was doing really great, powerful work in the neighborhood, and we really wanted to support them. They mentioned to us that registration and sign-in was very manual. They used just pen and paper, and it was a big pain point for them. So we thought, wonderful, we can build you a tool for that. We can build something that automates that, that lets you use that data in interesting ways, so we got to work. We spent six weeks, and we did it for free, to build them a system that we were really excited about. We showed it to them, and their reaction was, that's cute, we'll use pen and paper. And what we learned was, we asked them, what's your pain point? That's the main question, right? And they said registration and sign-in. But what we didn't ask them was, is this pain point painful enough that you try something else? And there are two really important lessons here. One is the fact that, we showed our own bias. As technologists, it's very easy for us to pick up a new tool, a new framework, a new solution, if we think it'll be faster, cheaper, more efficient. But for a bigger organization, they had a slight fear of technology that we didn't really think about. But the second, to me, more interesting lesson here is that we didn't really care if they actually needed this app. We didn't care whether or not it was painful enough because we already decided that we were going to build this app. We were so obsessed, so excited about the idea that we could play a small role in this important institution that we didn't ask real questions. We asked convenient questions. We asked just the number of questions we needed to make a feature list. We asked just enough to spec out the project. 